uh, you know, when I look to his future, it's like a, he can go so far where I cannot even see where he will be in a few years from now. He just become world champion last weekend. Yeah. <laughs> I think I was gonna get my black belt today. I kind of have a feeling when, oh man, but it's, it's, a, it's an unreal experience. You know, I've been training for going on 14 years now, like 70% of my life. And um, yeah, I mean, I've been through some ups and downs in my career, but this is definitely an up. Like I've been wanting to get my black belt for as long as I can remember. Um, and you know, I want to thank every one of you guys. Like, you know, I know I'm sometimes a little bit of a douche to you guys. <laughs> But, you know, I, I, won't, I won't tease you guys if I don't like you. Like, you know, I tease you because I love you guys and because you guys have helped me through this. And, um, you know, I want to thank my professor. I want to thank my brothers, Cody, Caleb Davis, Smokey, everyone that has just, like, helped me to this moment. Um, you know, it's just unreal. I can't believe I'm a black belt. I remember seeing my brother get a black belt a little over a year ago, and I was like, damn, I won't get my black belt for so long, but like, good for him. <laughs> you know, now, now I'm a black belt. It's, it's, it's just crazy. Um, you know, now I get to compete as a black belt. I get to train as a black belt. It's a professor. <laughs> what should I expect from you to call me professor? <laughs> but yeah, I, I appreciate you guys. You know, this, this gym is amazing. I can't believe I get to get my black belt under my Professor Rodrigo. Um, yeah, let's go, guys. Thank you so much. All right, man. We're here at Fire Factory. Just got your black belt today. What are you thinking? Um, you know, it's a pretty crazy, surreal moment. Like, I've been training for going on 14 years now, and Wow, the journey's been long, but it's been so awesome. Um, I've been dreaming about getting my black belt for so long just because, you know, it's just a, such a big achievement for somebody to achieve a black belt. And just it too, like, it's taken me 70% of my life. Like, I started when I was like six, and now I'm, you know, going on 20. So it's, um, it's pretty awesome, you know. Uh, I'm so grateful for just everything that, you know, I've been through and everything that I've learned in competition, everything that I've learned, you know, in the gym. Um, it's just made me grow as a person so much, just get working towards a black belt because it's such a long goal um, and when a goal is so long you really have to focus on every little step to achieve it you can't just go out there work hard and get it you have to become the black belt you have to become a good person you know you have to live it you can't just you know be a black belt you have to live the black belt too so you know it's super cool to be finally be able to have gotten this opportunity to get this from you know such an amazing professor um, you know professor Rodrigo has been so cool and you know I'm just so excited I can't wait to compete this year as a black belt <laughs> I'll get to challenge myself against you know tougher opponents now more high-level people um, so yeah it's, it's uh it's crazy <laughs> I, I was pretty I'm pretty speechless um, you know it's it's a little different feeling like winning worlds or something like that it's more of just a uh, less like the, the work has been done feeling like winning world this is more of like something I've been waiting for my whole life so um, it's that's a pretty great feeling just finally getting something that I've been waiting for for my entire life um, but yeah now working towards a red belt um, <laughs> I don't I don't know how long that'll be I'll probably be old and gray by the time I get that but yeah let's uh, got some big competitions coming up got some good challenges and you know now everyone has to call me professor in the gym so that'll be pretty cool too I teach kids 
class and the kids called me Coach Andrews at Brown Belt, but now they get to call me Professor Andrew. So um, like, li <laughs> like, line up, yes, Professor. Like, that's gonna be so sick. <laughs> but yeah, I, I just wanna thank, you know, I wanna thank my team. I wanna thank the people that have supported me online. I wanna thank, um, you know, I just wanna thank everybody that's been there for me. Um, yeah, it's, it's so awesome. I'm so grateful. Yeah, so what kind of goals do you have for Black Belt now in the um, competition? I want to compete in the Gi this year. Um, my expectations in the Gi are high, but you know I haven't really competed in the Gi in a while and I haven't been training in the Gi, so the expectation, expectations are high, but I'm probably not going to do that good, but my goal is to eventually win Gi Pans, win Gi Worlds. Like I want to be up there, so I, I want to compete in the Gi this year. I want to do Opens, get my points up, and be able to compete in the Pans and Worlds. Um, I'm going to be competing at more of a higher level in the Nogi, so I'm going to be hitting some really high level super fights, probably on who's number one. Um, hopefully, um, you guys will see me in the future competing on one championship, so I want to get some high level fights on there as well. Um, so yeah, I just got some plans for big things, more experienced opponents, more, you know, black belt level stuff, so that's exciting. Because brown belt was a tough year, but um, so black belt's going to be a super tough year, so I'm just excited for the challenges I have ahead and the challenges you know of just seeing how i'm going to grow from this this belt um it's it's awesome